The Company of the American Islands French, Compagnie des Isles de l'Amérique was a French chartered company that in 1635 took over the administration of the French portion St. Christophe Island from Compagnie de St. Christophe which was the only French settlement in the Caribbean at that time, and was mandated to actively colonize other islands. The islands settled for France under the direction of the Compagnie des Isles de l'Amérique before it was dissolved in 1651 were Dominica 1632, formerly as Compagnie de Saint-Christophe Guadeloupe the 28th of June 1635 to 1649 Martinique, the 15th of September 1635 to the 27th of September 1650. Saint Lucia, 1643 to the 27th of September 1650. Saint Martin, the 23rd of March 1648. Saint Barts, 1648. Granada, the 17th of March 1649 to the 27th of September 1650. Saint Croix, 1650. In 1635, France's Cardinal Richelieu charged François Fouquet, the head of a small group of his councillors, with revitalizing the less than dynamic Company de Saint Christophe in which the cardinal was a shareholder. Fouquet did so, renaming the company, Compagnie des Isles de l'Amérique. The company was charged with developing the islands of the Antilles, including converting their inhabitants to Catholicism. Pierre Bellin Sieur Desnambuc, who had founded the Compagnie de Saint Christophe, landed in Martinique in 1635, commencing France's colonization of that island. On 15 September 1635, Pierre Belaine Desnambuc, French governor of the island of St. Kitts, landed in the harbour of St. Pierre with 150 French settlers after being driven off St. Kitts by the English. Desnambuc claimed Martinique for the French King Louis XIII and the French Compagnie des Isles de l'Amérique. Company of the American Islands, and established the first European settlement at Fort Saint-Pierre now Saint-Pierre under Governor Jean Dupont. Desnambuc died prematurely in 1636, leaving the company and Martinique in the hands of his nephew, Du Parquet. In 1637, his nephew Jacques Dial Du Parquet became governor of the island. Du Parquet proceeded to colonize Martinique, established the first settlement in St. Lucia in 1643, and headed an expedition which established a French settlement in Granada in 1649. In 1642 the company received a 20-year extension of its charter. The king would name the governor-general of the company, and the company the governors of the various islands. However, by the late 1640s, in France Mazarin had little interest in colonial affairs and the company languished. In 1651 it dissolved itself, selling its exploitation rights to various parties. The Du Pocket family bought Martinique, Grenada, and Saint Lucia for 60,000 livres. The Sierre Duel bought Guadeloupe, Marie Galante, La Desirade, and the Saintes. Philippe de Longvilliers de Poincy was a French nobleman and bailiff Grand Cross of the Knights of Malta. He governed the island of St. Christopher from 1639 to his death in 1660, first under the Compagnie des Isles de l'Amérique and later under the Knights of Malta themselves. Poincy was the key figure in the hospitaller colonization of the Americas. 
The Knights of Malta bought St. Christophe, St. Croix, St. Barthélemy, and St. Martin. In 1665, the Knights sold the islands they had acquired to the newly formed 1664 Company des Indies Occidentales. Topic. See also European chartered companies founded around the 17th century in French. Topic. Sources World State Smins see each relevant island state.